Hello, welcome to Lockdown at the Zoo Part 2. I'm here with our orangutans today. So we have six Borneo orangutans here at Painting Zoo. We have five females and one lucky male we've sent. And I'll just tell you a little bit about them all individually. Uh, I'll start with Marley and Tatao. So Marley is our adult female. She's 25 years old um, and she's mother to Tatao, who's seven. They're right over there um, at the end of the island. Um, foraging for some food that I've put out for them. Marley's been here for 13 years. Um, she came to us in 2007 from Munster Zoo in Germany. Um, she came at the same time as another young male, um, a rank called Dima. Um, he came from a different zoo to breed, so that was the purpose of them two coming together. Dima was quite young, uh, young when he first arrived here, so it was quite a long time before he actually bred with Marley. Um, but eventually he did, and in 2013 we welcomed uh, the child to the world. So she was the first orangutan to be born here for 16 years. Um, so she's quite special in that respect. And then eight months later, um, her half-sister arrived in the world to Mother Chinta. Um, so we had the two babies. Unfortunately, we did lose Demo in 2014. Um, he was chronically ill, um, he had poor health. And it was quite a tragic time for us all, as you can imagine. Um, but we've got his legacy in Tatao and Natalia. And if you can see them in the background there, you can see that they're doing really well. Um, and we're very lucky to have them here at the zoo. So, moving on from Marley and Tatao, I'm not actually sure if you can see anyone else at the moment. Um, we have, on the big island, uh, Wusan, who's our male, uh, Chinta and Natalia. Um, so you might just be able to make them out through the tree there. Uh, Natalia is the youngster at the top, uh, as I said she's six years old. Um, Chinta is her mother, who's our oldest orangutan here at the zoo, she's 30 years old. And then Wusan um, is just a sub-adult male, he's 12 years old. So he is sexually mature but is not a full adult yet, it'll be a few years yet until he is a big impressive male. But he seems to enjoy having all the ladies around him, so he's living his life, best life at the moment. So Chinta... Out of all the orangutans we've had over the years, um, she's our only original left. So we first got orangutans at Painton Zoo in 1992. Chinta was just two years old when she arrived from London Zoo with her mum, Senja. And she's been here ever since. Um, and well, she seems to like it. And obviously now she's got uh, Natalia as well. And a new young male on the block. Um, so Wusan we've had for about three years now. He arrived in 2017. He came from Cologne Zoo, and again, for the purpose of breeding. We are part of the European Breeding Programme here at Paynton. Um, both our babies are old enough now for the mums to get pregnant again. However, we do have Marley and Tatao separate, um, so the, that's why they're on a different island. Um, Wusan, Shinta and Natalia are part of the group together. So the hope is that he will breed with Chinta at some point in due course. Um, and the only other orangutan left to mention is Gambera. Now, Gambera is usually in the main group with Wusan, Chinta and Natalia. Um, she's currently not in the group at the moment and she's off show uh, because she's recovering from some leg surgery. Um, but we have actually started putting Natalia back in with her, so she's got company and the hope is that she will again integrate back into the group when she is better. So Gambera is a very special lady to us all. Um, we call her Princess Gambera. She was the first orangutan to be born at Pinton Zoo. So she was born in, I can't remember off the top of my head, but she's 23 years old. Um, she was born to Bulu, who came from London Zoo as well. And she's been here with us the whole time. And even though she's not bred herself, although she has been with males, um, she does play an important role here. She's really, really good with the youngsters. Um, so we call her Auntie Scambira as well. Um, Natalia absolutely loves her. Um, they do spend a lot of time together. So it's really nice to see that even though she might not breed, um, she is part of the group and she does integrate really well. So that's everyone. They get on really well together. Um, the, the main group, Glen Marley and Tat and it's nice that they're outside enjoying the sunshine and that's about it thank you